So we're about to do a dramatic reveal. Yes. Cause I'm not, I'm scared. I might have to go over it with the darker color depending how dark it is. So let's do this. I'm gonna pull it off. You want me to do it? Mm -hmm. Fucking yeet. <laughs> oh no, I don't want to. Fuck. Oh. <laughs> This is the current state of my really disgusting hair. As you guys can see, like, oh my god. Now we're going to Sally's. I feel really crazy because I've actually never filmed at this angle, so I don't know how this looks like at all. I have no idea what color I'm gonna do. I'm literally like right here, like I can see Sally's. I just know that I don't wanna do blue. I love blue on me. I think that's my favorite color, especially like the lighter blues. But again, I'm bored. I, I don't know, I'm just like, I can never make up my mind. I, as you guys know, I've really wanted to do lime green for a really long time, but that's gonna be a really long process and that's probably not gonna happen until next year. So I kinda wanna do pink, like how I always do, cause if I do pink, it's just gonna gradually fade to like a pink and a purple. As you can see, it's like doing all these funky colors, but it's pretty like, it's not brassy, it's just yellow cause we didn't tone it or anything, but that's what I do every single time. We just just bleach the roots out and now we're just gonna put color on it and here we are at the most beautiful place on earth I literally look insane right now like when I was walking in the store like I just look crazy but these are the two little hair colors that I picked up so if you guys have watched any of my hair dyeing videos you'll know that this is typically the only hair dye brand that I use this is the one and only argan oil in perfect intensity and the one that I got this time was hot pink I have used this numerous times I know you guys are probably like but it's blue um, but like kind of how I said earlier it'll kind of fade into like a hot pink into a purple I'll show a picture of like Last time that I did this which was well over a year ago but yeah this is the only hair dye that I love to use the only thing that sucks is they are very limited on the colors that they do offer which sucks because I don't know I only trust this one like I just love the way that it makes my hair feel because it's, it is infused like with argan oil and stuff so my hair just feels so much softer it feels healthier especially because you know the blonde and everything but yeah we're just gonna see what this does I quickly just realized that I sounded so stupid because I could have a lot of you guys already know are gonna say like why didn't you uh, color remove your hair or bleach wash it or something like that you know so you could have a nice fresh base but if you guys didn't know I did have colored hair like bleach white hair and then I went to black and within a matter of like three months I was like I don't want to do black hair anymore so I bleached it back so I don't want to bleach wash it because it will damage it completely and then I just don't want to color remove it because I've tried like a bunch of different methods and it's just never worked like the only thing that's ever truly worked on my hair is a bleach wash so I don't want to do that I've tried tons and tons of color remover plus I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's pretty freaking light This is about a tube and also I want to show you guys the length of my hair So my hair like barely touches my boobs forgot to mention I do shower not all the time but like when it's freshly dyed like the first three washes I shower with gloves on just because to usually I do have like fake nails on and it will stain the living crap out of them it'll stain the crap out of my hands and everything so if you wear gloves it just you miss all that if you guys have watched any of my hair dyeing videos you would have seen me use the hot pink multiple times and all the tragedies that it's done well now because for some reason my bleach really took this is what it did I haven't had this happen since when I first started bleaching my hair which was like in 2015 literally but that was when um, my hair was all one solid color and as we saw it had blue so here's the thing this is what it looks like brushed out it looks so incredibly crazy on camera like way more bright I mean it's still um you know doing the six nine thing but i don't hate it but i'm also feel like i might have to go over it like put a purple over it just so it blends and does like a purple thing so i might have purple hair for a while but we'll see because i had to wait for it 
to dry and then once it's dry I'm gonna determine my fate of my hair it's the next day and I decided I was like trying to sit on it like should I leave my hair like this like should I just let it like fade out and or whatever and I decided I just like don't like I want one kind of solid color and so I had like a little bit of my electric teal like from the same brand you can see I have it on my hands and I was kind of testing it right here to see what would happen before I completely dye it and it kind of started turning it like the same color it as you can see it kind of like went up because it was like this and I just brought it up like that and yeah it seemed to pretty much turn it the same color so I just went ahead and went to Sally's and I got just a full one of the electric teal and hopefully it'll all kind of be like a solid color maybe not just because I did just freshly dye my hair so there's a lot of molecules and everything so I don't know how it's going to pick up might not pick up a at all like how it did in my previous videos but I mean I was testing it out I was testing it out up here because it was like right here and I was kind of seeing what would happen as you can see and it was all kind of turning it like the same color so yeah that's just what we're gonna do we're gonna go ahead and uh re-dye my hair and hopefully it'll all be like the same and my hair is blue I just know that I don't want to do blue and I decided to show you guys in my backyard in the outside lighting just because every time I use filming lights it picks up like weird different colors and it never looks as like natural as if I were to just go outside and show you so yeah it's blue it's not purple it's amazing how every time I mess up my hair I always put blue over it Julie literally said the amount of money that she would have by now because I do this so often literally every single one of my videos I mess up my hair and then I just put blue over it and everything's all good so I could have just done this to begin with you know my hair didn't have to go through all that pain so this is the natural hair right here I obviously have extensions in like my hair is not this long I didn't brush it all the way so it kind of looks all like naughty and stuff but still we have like an even you know nice blend going on we don't have any weird cutoffs like we did earlier which honestly I didn't hate but I just like this way better like I said I love blue on my hair the best I think it just personally fits my face better so yeah that's pretty much it I'm not mad at it I don't hate my hair I actually like it I'm glad that it you know didn't turn purple in a way which I was like kind of excited to be purple but whatever meant to be blue and yeah that is pretty much it uh for this entire video which i feel like was pointless because i just ended up going blue again kind of wanted something exciting to happen but nothing really happened except a big fat fail so here we are i guess i will see you guys in my next video bye